What is going on, everybody? Sports expert here. We do have some breaking news in the MLB. Okay, Mark Canna, who had been rumored to be on the trade block for a bit here with the New York Mets, he is headed to the Milwaukee Brewers. The Milwaukee Brewers are adding another bat after they added Carlos Santana. They're trying to go all in here at the trade line, so they're trying to make some moves with their offense. And yeah, Mark Canna is headed to the Milwaukee Brewers for pitching prospect Justin Jarvis, who is very, an interesting name. He was a fifth-round pick in 2018. He's a, the Brewers' 30th prospect currently, so they do get a top 30 of the Mets. We'll see where he fits in their system, but interesting return there for the Mets. But getting rid of Canna makes sense. They're not contending. They're already selling at the deadline, and a guy like Canna was on a rental contract, so getting something for him makes sense. So, But the Brewers are adding a right-handed hitting outfielder who – has put up a 724 OPS this year, 245 average with six homers, 29 RBIs. So, you know, not a flashy bat, but he's a guy that has a lot of veteran experience. He's on the older side. He could definitely help some of the younger guys and help slug, especially against some left-handed pitching. That could definitely help. So the Brewers, not terrible, not a terrible move. You know, the Mets are going to take on some money. I don't know how much money they're going to take on, but I don't, can't, I don't think they really said too much about the money yet, but we'll find out there. And But when you're looking at it, at the players, I mean, it's a fine deal for both teams. Nothing crazy, but nothing bad. So Mark Canna, I'm going to give the Brewers an A in this trade. I do th like it for them. I do think it's definitely going to add some, you know, some. it's going to help culture because Mark Canna is a nice guy. He's a guy everyone loves to be around, a great teammate. For the Mets, I will give it a B plus. You know, they got an okay prospect in return. You know, it's just unfortunate that this team, for this team, it was unfortunate for them that they had to sell to their poor performance this year. Now they're ending up with guys like Justin Jarvis. Not ideal, but fine return. I mean, it's Mark Cannon on a rental contract. What are you going to do about that? Making a bit of money. So that's what we have. But we, you know, we've had some more trades come up. We'll have to do videos on those too. But Mark Canna is headed to the, the Milwaukee Brewers. And we have another. We had another trade, Jamer Candelario. I probably should have done this one first because Candelario is arguably the best bat on the market. He is headed to the Chicago Cubs, where he was originally traded from to the Detroit Tigers. He's going back to the Cubs for DJ Hers, a prospect. Not sure where he plays. Ne never really heard of him, DJ Hers, but he's headed to the Washington Nationals for Jamer Candelario. Condolari was one of the better bats at the deadline this year, so the Cubs are probably paying a solid price. If not, then quite the robbery. And Kevin Maid is going to the Nationals. Not sure who that is. He's a shortstop, though, in the Candelario deal. So they're getting him as well. Very solid switch hitting. Third baseman, first baseman, wherever you want to play him. He hits the ball well, hits it hard, is able to get on base, able to hit doubles, you know. Candelaria was a bit limited with the Tigers last season, just didn't perform up to expectations, but he puts up a very solid first half of the season with the Nationals and rebuilds value for the trade deadline. Definitely solid for a guy like Mike Rizzo, who was looking to get some of these guys to sell off for prospects. So Candelaria was more than likely going to move today. He was not in the lineup today. Eldemardo Vargas was, so he's gone. But yeah, he is headed to the Chicago Cubs. For the Nationals, I can't really grade this one too much because I really don't know much about the prospects. I'll give it a B plus, I guess. And for the Cubs, I'll give it an A. You know, getting a nice pickup in Candelaria, arguably one of the better bats available. So makes sense here. And yeah, I mean, it looks like the Cubs are buying at the deadline now. So Cody Bellinger and Marcus Stroman are off the market. So I appreciate everyone being here. Sports Expert, please hit the subscribe button near the channel. Turn on the post notification bell. Like the video. Comment what you think. Jay McCandelario to the Cubs and Mark Hanna to the Brewers. I'm out, guys. Sports Expert here. Peace.